Good morning. This is Tony and Rose Kitchen. Today I'm creating arancini. Everybody knows who's ar what's arancini. But arancini, mainly they are made with rice, 100%. And you can do it with whatever you want. I remember I used to do them when I was a cook and a chef at Sims Metal in Brooklyn. I used to make arancini with rice, of course, but, and the Aussies, they love them. I remember there was a bloke named Mark, I never voiced said, please, Tony, if you make arancini, make them with salami, please. It's so, all right, so what's the difference? You can make them with ham, you can make them with chicken, you know, you can make them with whatever you want, after all. But today I'm making arancini out of mashed potato. How about that? I'm going to create this. So what I've got here in the blender, a full onion, onion, mashed on the blender so you don't come onions in your mouth. I've got here 13 to 14 pieces salami. Any salami you want. I've got here about 20 or 25 pieces Kalamata olives. Okay? I've got in there about one, two, three, four, five, six, about eight potato, which I'm going to mash, but I'm not going to mash them very soft, just tender. Uh, boil them tender, just tender. Put the knife in and that's it. Once it goes in, okay, stop it. Don't, don't leave it, don't make them too mushy. So what I've got here, I've got mozzarella cheese. Okay, I've got mozzarella cheese which I'm going to put with the mashed potato. And I put about one, two tablespoon, one, two tablespoon of self-rising flour, and I put at least one egg. It's good enough. Then I make them into a bowl, and I put them into breadcrumbs. Once I put them into breadcrumbs, then I put them in a deep oil, in the frying deep oil. And they should be mashed potato arancini. And they, are, they should be good. This is the first time I'm doing them. I done arancino with the rice. I had no problem. But today, you know, you got so many different rice for arancini, for uh, boiling, for the, for the soup. You got rice for, what they call it, rice for So You got rice for Chinese, fry rice for Chinese. You got so many rice. And we're never going to rise up because we're going to go down. So you got so many. Anyway, I always use Bessema rice. It doesn't bother me, you know. And uh, they do a lot of things with rice and a lot of different rice for, for different stuff. In the olden days, we didn't have this craziness. Months of many way. We are, you know, and, and, and the, uh, we're advantage now and hopefully we think we go forward. So I'm going to check the potato. I'm going to mash the potato with egg. One egg is good enough for eight. With mozzarella cheese, with salami, with olives, a tablespoon of crushed garlic. No salt, okay? Don't put salt because everything is salty. One full onion mash and butter. And put some butter with the thing. And I put them out maybe one to two tablespoon of self-rising flour. I mix them all together and then I make them into a bowl and I dip them into the uh, breadcrumbs and I put them into the oil. I will show you how they come. I just wanted to tell you that I'm doing arancini. Mashed potato arancini. Not with rice. Okay? We'll try it like that and we'll see. I know it will come good, come soft comes a bit salty with Kalamata olives, all right? So don't add any salt, any salt or any pepper, please. Nothing. Just leave it as they are. Salami, Kalamata olives, garlic, onion mesh, mozzarella cheese, flour, eggs, and breadcrumbs. I'm going to try it and I'll show you how they come, okay? I will do another video. And I thank you. God bless.